grab this one. And Quest is going across the street, well, the next block, and uh, hit up the backyard. Um, we mowed this a couple of weeks ago, no, not a couple of, a couple of days ago, and it was too wet in the back, so we're returning to the same neighborhood, and we're gonna go, go ahead and finish up that one in the back. So, uh, let's get this back on track.
this is the uh, final result. Nice edge on the bed. And this is what the back looks like. Now around the tree right there, it holds water. And I mean, it is extremely, extremely wet. This whole back holds water. So whenever it rains, you have to give this place three or four days longer than the average yard to dry out. All right. Now guys, let me show you something real quick for you guys just learning. You see things like this? You have to document this. You always have to document this and take pictures when you first come in and take over a property. Why? Because if they claim that that was you, then you have proof, pictures. Hold on to pictures. So whenever you start on a property, the first thing you want to do is walk around the property and take pictures of anything that was done prior to you actually mowing. Okay? Don't mow first and then take pictures because you don't want to be held liable for something that you didn't do. That's the tip of the day. <laughs> we have a lot of energy, guys. All right, on to the next.